Hi, I'm Vanessa with the Newport, Oregon Public Library, and I am here to tell you about another book in our juvenile collection. This is a paranormal genre, you know, the one that has like ghosts and witches and vampires in it. Well, this book just has a witch, and it is called The Girl Who Drank the Moon, and it's by Karen Barnhill. So it tells the story of a baby that was sacrificed to a forest witch to keep her from terrorizing the town but it turns out the witch is actually really kind and gentle and she lives in the forest with her teeny tiny dragon and a swamp monster. I picture Shrek for some reason. Um, so the witch, Zan, she rescues these babies and delivers them to families on the other side of the forest and she feeds them starlight along the way. And that's really important because one year, Zan, the witch, accidentally feeds an infant moonlight and she fills this child with an extraordinary magic and uh, she decides she's gonna have to raise this in magic child herself so she names the baby Luna this is Luna and um, she binds Luna's magic until she's 13 and doesn't tell her about it she keeps it a secret um, and she does this to keep Luna safe is what we're told so as Luna approaches her 13th birthday Things begin to change. The magic she didn't know she had kind of begins to burst and emerge out of her in surprising and uncontrollable ways. Um, and at the exact same time, the villagers, the townspeople decide it's time to kill the forest witch. And they are determined to come in and find Zan and destroy her. But Zan is nowhere to be found. She's not available right now. She can't help. So Luna is on her own. She needs to learn how to control her magic. She has to um, protect her friends and keep everyone safe, all while trying to figure everything out. And remember, she's only 13. So can she do all this? Uh, you'll have to read it to find out. So check out The Girl Who Drank the Moon by Karen Barnhill, available at the Newport Library and also digitally on your devices at home. And I will see you at the library.